Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Sly Cooper Thievius Raccoonus. Um, in the last episode we were talking about, um... Yeah. Well, actually no, how to train your dragon. Yeah, well, both of them. Yeah. But like, um, like I was saying in the last one, the Netflix adaptation, not, it's not an adaptation. It's a, uh, the it's Netflix like a, show. It's like a sequel series. Yeah. It was, uh, apparently it was fucking terrible. Because... You, they go so they reference uh, in the it's first the in between of uh, the adventures of Hiccup and the dragons, right? Yeah. They meet new dragons and they try to find more species of dragons. That's the whole uh, basis of the story of the show. Okay. And then when they continued it, it goes on to like future years, like future way years. way farther. It's it's beyond the time of. The Vikings. Yes, they call so that. It's, like, it, it, it's current time. So it's like future. Oh, like our present day. Yeah, like somewhat our present day. Oh, that's uh, that's interesting. I heard that. And apparently, it is god awful. I don't know, dude. Like it just doesn't fit. With, like the story. Did you stuff. ever? Did you ever watch it? Or did, I did not this, watch is this it. Just what you heard. I, this is just what I heard. And this is it's sad because it's it's the children, though. Like Toothless is, I think Toothless is dead. Oh really? Yes. And, oh well, and now yeah, it's his actually, kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's and his the, kid go. Yeah, but this, the, what's sad is that um, it's not like a continuation where like you know like oh uh, the kids of Toothless become friends with the kid uh, the kids of um, Hiccup. Yeah. Hic Hiccup's like lineage is gone. It's gone. Like the Vikings are dead. It's current time, and now the dragons are the one that lasted the longest. Oh, no humans then. Yeah, humans are alive, but it's now current day humans. And like, they see like, oh my god, Vikings, like, uh, Viking stuff. Oh, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Like, what is this stuff? Are these, like, these dragons, like, alive since, like, Viking times or stuff like that? Okay. And then they just go on adventures uh, with, uh, with the dragons and stuff. But it's like, why would you do that? Why not continue like the story with with Hiccup's kids and Hic and Toothless kids? Yeah, you know? that's what I don't really get. Maybe they want to do some world building or some shit. I don't know. Maybe, but like the, the world, there were still so many species yet to be discovered. You know? Yeah. What if there is another like you know like remember the in the second one where like there's like a big alpha? Yeah, I kind of do remember. Yeah, what if they What if they made like another big, big alpha or something, or like another giant dragon? Maybe they didn't want to like repeat like different stuff. I guess so. I don't know. But, but yeah. it's kind of a given for the series to not be as good as a as a actual movie though. Yeah, that's that's a giant hit or miss. I feel like. Yeah. Because ooh, 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 you almost died right there. I got his ass off. Um, when it comes to this like TV sh uh, series, like when comes to that stuff it's it, it can really destroy like a series to be, to be honest. yeah the only good thing that i can think of was madagascar the, the penguins i actually love that show no for real i love I that love show that, that, love that was a good show. show yeah that was a good show that was a worthy addition to the madagascar it uh, really series. was it really was they did a, an amazing job and i i sort of remember the uh the 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 poe like animated series that they oh, had? Oh, yeah, yeah. Kung Fu Panda Legends of Awesome. Yeah, I thought it was alright, but not as good as the movies. Yeah, yeah. I remember watching it. I remember watching the first episode, and it was, like, pretty pretty interesting. Like, the, uh, what's amazing is that they kept touching upon, um, they, they touched upon, uh, Tai Lung. They even brought back Tai Lung, yeah. too. Yeah, yeah, I kind of remember that as well. They, um, Tai Lung's nephew, um, the, 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 what was the prison called? Um, I was gonna say Boston Say, but that's fucking Avatar. <laughs> that, that's Avatar. I don't. I actually don't know. I don't remember. It's but, been a while since I've watched Kung Fu Panda. Um, what's it called? Uh, yeah, but like there was a guard in the uh from from that from the prison. Yeah, and he actually like blamed the dragon warrior for losing his job because literally the only the only um prisoner they had was uh tai Lung. and since he was gone 
like there's no there's no need for for guards anymore. He's dead. They uh, Poe killed him. Dude, he smacked his ass. <laughs> Fucked him up. Yep. He he clenched his butt cheeks and then launched him like a hundred feet. Yeah, in the exactly, air. exactly. Poe's just that guy. Yep. Freeze when my heart warms at the very sight of He is the Chad of Chad. He is the Chad. Do you think Poe would uh cop um Carmelita? <laughs> Oh, what, bro? <laughs> Carmelita is like a sniper wolf and like uh, her boyfriend. Yeah, that, like, but no, no, no. But Poe is way better than that's true, that's that true, that's true, that's was. True. Whoever that dude was. I don't even know his name, bro. Dude, how can he flop that bad and losing sniper wolf? Yeah, I don't even know. Why was she even into him? Like, this dude was I think, like. I personally think, mm -hmm. like, it was like he paid her type, type shit. Like, you really think that. Yeah, because, like, I can't. Like I like bro, okay, how does it make sense? How does it make sense? Okay, okay, let's not be let's not be like too too judgmental. No no no, okay. okay. Like, but the guy doesn't even have a personality. That's what I'm saying though. Right. He doesn't even he doesn't even have a personality where it, I could see like oh okay. Like, it's it's okay. one of those things where it's like it's charismatic, you know. This dude is like pretty fucking like boring to like the max. Is yeah. What bro. You're saying. I, I like I don't get it bro. Yeah, I don't I don't and I don't get like did he get too cocky? To a point where, like, he's like, you know what? I'm the only guy she'll ever love. Cause yeah. like, you gotta be, you gotta be fucking stupid if you think like, you have ultimate riz just because you got one girl. I mean, one hot ass girl, I'll say that. But like, yeah, only one girl. But even then, though, like, you, it's just, like, at the moment, you would have, you want to think that, like, you want to second guess yourself and be like, you know what? I'm gonna I'm a go for another girl or I'm gonna treat her terribly because I'm the one who made this relationship work or something like that. You know? Oh, he's a dumbass. Have you seen her content? Nah. At all? I haven't seen her in such a long time. Why? She, it's boring. It's incredibly boring. It is frustrating. Dude, oh my god, every time, because like my sister, she oh, sometimes. She watches it? No, she doesn't watch it on purpose. She just watches it on accident. Right? Yeah. Or like, how do I explain this? It's just like, you know how like kids just be scrolling through YouTube like no matter what? Yeah, this is Yeah, like... it, her videos just pop up. I don't play. Just yeah. yeah. But her, like, she's a reaction channel now. Oh, of course. And it's so terrible. She just, her reactions are so forced and her jokes are like, god awful. They're jokes to like, they're literally targeted for little, like, like smaller audiences. Little children, right? Yes. I mean, hey, man. I'm not surprised that she's a, a reaction channel. Most of the YouTubers from back then that were like crazy like that are just like reaction stuff now. Yeah. And that's that's kind of sad, because like you know like, all these like big Call of Duty YouTubers, and like. They used to be so good, bro. Dude, they they like they're. They would probably they would be the domination of, of YouTube. Yeah, they would, but they're not no more. Cause yeah. you cause Call of Duty is not crazy like that no more. Honestly, I yeah. think that's the main reason why. Yeah, cause Call of Duty uh, it became uh, that that's like kind of like the big debate right now, saying how like they're, they're say, people are saying that Call of Duty became bad because of the competitive aspects of nah, it. Nah, I don't think it's that. I think it's just like. It, they just did too much every year. I think that's what what it was. You think that like they try to like change so much that it became just uh, a repetitive process? Yeah, now? sort of, sort of. Yeah, cause like, ooh, cause like it, it, what was it like? So it was they kind of went futuristic in Black Ops Two, right? Yup. And then, bro, damn, damn, got my ass two times. They they try to go futuristic, uh, then. What was it? Then it was Modern Warfare after Black Ops 2, right? Yeah. Modern Warfare 3? Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, it's a it's a mix of, like, uh, futuristic stuff with Black Ops 2, and then you go back to, like, modern day with Modern Warfare. And then it just... Uh, what's next? Then it was uh, Sledgehammer Games with... Infi uh, with Infinite Man. Warfare? Yeah. No, Advanced Warfare, wasn't it? Oh, yeah, 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 Advanced. I, I, yeah. yeah. I and it goes to Advanced Warfare, Warfare where, like, this whole new change of tactics where, like, you're jumping around, like, the sky. The exo so we got exo suit now. We got exo suit. And then, after Advanced Warfare, what was it? It was, a uh, uh, Black Ops 3? Yeah, but Black Ops 3 was good, though. Yeah. 
But Trango Boom, though. Trango, Trango Boom. Boom. Trango Boom. I will say that. Yeah. But yeah, like, the I feel like the franchise really kind of fell off uh, around that time when it became... Bruh! Did it actually call you? But you're good, though. Oh, okay. I was about to say. Because you don't have, uh, you have that ability from the ancestor. But yeah, like... Bruh! Again, bro? <laughs> like, the, the need to, like, change everything, I feel like that's what causes them to lose so much. That's that's what causes them to like, you know, lose appeal pretty fast. Let me just interrupt this chase sequence to get a a, a secret. I gotta get my essay out of this safe. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, my teacher's gonna be pissed at me. Wait, careful, leader. I can. I just gotta get my essay, please. You think you're gonna fool me, raccoon? No, please. I, I'm I'm dead ass. I need my essay right now. <laughs> like all his brains, like just. Now I got you now. I got you now, raccoon. Oh, fucking hiccups. I can't deal with it. Like What'd you get? Oh, oh it's. You can see bottles throughout the. the Damn, world. I dead ass need that in like the last half of the game. That's what I'm saying. This is just stupid. What am I gonna use that for, bro? It doesn't even do anything. Probably like the last, last level of this of this world. <laughs> Yeah, last world. This is the well, the last full world at least. Is yeah. It? Damn. Got my eye. Oh shit! I didn't even know there was a thing. Yeah, there's some more. There we go. Yeah, get your. Watch your back, Cooper. When you least expect. She's just Watch slowly, back, Cooper. Slowly falling to her death. Slowly falling, and she's just waving her fist. Oh, she dies. <laughs> she just died, bro. We just killed oh, her ass. She's dead. We committed murder, bro. Sly, did you, you just killed the most, the most notorious Interpol agent out there in the world. We're gonna get locked up for this shit. What? You're into murder now, Sly? I didn't sign up for this. You're Bentley. stuck with me, Bentley. Don't Bentley. you fucking dare. <laughs> Bentley b becomes like the hostage of the of the crew. <laughs> and Fine. then, and then um. Uh, Murray is just too retarded to understand what's happening. No, Murray is just like, it's not that he's retarded. He's just like the trauma of knowing that Sly kills. Oh yeah. He's just, he's just too much on. It's, it's too much that he just ignores it. Yeah. He he just um uh, to avoid the trauma he just like you know he just eats it. peanuts. Yep. Exactly. That's why he went on that spiritual journey in the third game because mm -hmm. Sly Cooper he just it was too too much for him. Yeah, it was just too much. All right. We'll continue this in the next episode. Yes, sir.